Welcome to Circuit Script Engineering, and in this video, I'm going to be making the pedals for a drifting simulator. In the previous video, I made the steering wheel, so please don't forget to check that out. But for now, let's get into it. I started by cutting a piece of 2x4 to the correct length. To it, I will mount all my pedals. I will cut a piece out of plywood to use as the pivoting part for the throttle pedal. I don't have any metal working machines, so I will 3D print the pedal pad itself. I will attach it to the plywood using two screws. I will also use a bearing for smooth pivoting motion. To reinforce the bearing from both sides, I 3D printed these rings out of PTG. All the paddles will pivot on a steel rod, so I 3D printed these parts to hold the rod in place. I decided to add a third part for extra reinforcement. The paddles will need to return to their original position, so I will use this thick rubber band to pull them back into place. In order to detect the position of the pedal, I will use these potentiometers. One for each, the throttle, the brake, and the clutch. For the control board, I will use the Arduino Pro Micro. It came unsoldered, so I'm going to need to solder these pins to it. These parts will connect the potentiometer to the 2x4 and will attach the pedal to the potentiometer using a wire. The throttle pedal is done, but I won't be able to use it unless I hold it up somehow. So I cut out three more pieces of wood to do that. I still need to make the brake and clutch pedals. Since basically all the parts from the throttle pedal are going to be reused, it was just a matter of 3D printing and assembling from now on. Kidding. It wasn't really like that, but the pedals work very well with the simulator as well as with my steering wheel. I can easily control the car and it's very fun in the end. I can't use the clutch, but that's okay because in the next video I'll be making the shifter and then it will be a full simulator. If you really like this video, please consider liking and subscribing to the channel. That way I can make more videos. I would like to say a big thanks to all my subscribers and all the people to comment to my previous video, the steering wheel that I made. Please don't forget to check that out. A few of these people are Jay Zayden, Strange YY EBX, and Aparna Pandi 9737. And to a lot of other people too. Thank you so much for commenting on my video. And please continue. The next step is to make the shifter and the handbrake. And that will be in part three of these video series.